Sveiki, this is Video Mokykla channel and informal Lithuanian video series. This is the lesson number 15, right? Ane? Ane is uh, a saying that is pretty common in informal Lithuanian. Uh, well, in spoken Lithuanian, because people speak this way. Uh, it can be translated as a question tag, as the saying OK or the saying right uh, in English. Uh, many times people speak, they say something and they say right or they say OK uh, or they use a question tag. Am I? Uh, aren't you? Isn't he? Uh, aren't we? And so on. Uh, so basically, uh, a name is a question tag. Or um, in an older textbook, I said I, I found that it's uh, it's um, it's called the tag question, but uh, again, it's the same word. So uh, I doubt uh, any textbook would feature this. Well, maybe some textbooks uh, which address colloquial Lithuanian would show this, but uh, I doubt. Uh, so, it can be translated as right, OK, or a question tag. And it is made from ar and ne. Ar is, of course, the inter interrogative particle. And interrogative means the particle for yes, no questions. Interrogative means the question particle. So, uh, when you're asking a yes, no question, you add an ar uh, to the beginning of the sentence and you get a question. Uh, I explained to you in the first lesson ever on this channel, uh, the Lithu Learn Lithuanian Lesson 1. So it should be clear for you. And ne of course means no. So uh, uh, a ne was made from uh, arne. arne. Uh, you can say arne when you're just uh, asking for a permission. Again, you're saying right or okay or uh, you're using a question tag. So you say arne, and you can say arne, and uh, basically uh, people use uh, arne also. They say arne, but uh, I would say that uh, in informal Lithuanian, arne is also very frequent. Uh, I would not dare to guess which one is more frequent, but um, but yeah, it's they're still easy to learn. And uh, I have uh, I have a video about uh, question tags, uh, those question tags Arne and Anne in the Easy Lithuanian video series. Uh, and uh, you can check out that video, it has about seven sentence examples uh, with Arne and Anne. So uh, if you want some more practice, you can go to that video and see those seven sentence examples. But now, uh, today we'll have three sentence examples. You're going home, aren't you? Vajuoji namo, ane? Vajuoji namo, ane? You can also say Vajuoji namo, arne? But people can also say ane. Vajuoji namo, ane? Vajuoji namo, ane? One more time. Vajuoji namo, ane? Now, uh, a good film, isn't it? Garas filmas, ane? Garas filmas, ane? Garas filmas, ane? One more time. Garas filmas, ane? Or Garas filmas, ane? Atvarisi, ane? You'll come, won't you? Because variti means to go. Uh, this was in the beginning of informal Thonian video series. And uh, atvarite means the same as ateite or atvažiuoti, um, which means to come. Atvarysi, ane? Atvarysi, ane? Atvarysi, ane? One last time, fast. Atvarysi, ane? Or atvarysi, ane? So this was it for this short lesson. I hope you enjoyed this lesson. Uh, for more, check out the website and blog with all video lessons on this channel. Uh, also, check out the ebooks with audio if there are some new ebooks at this time already uh, when this video is published. So, uh, yeah, 
Uh, this is it for this lesson. Thank you for listening. Acho que